It's Ricardo and welcome to another Blog Tech Tips. Today I'm going to give you a personal water test of the Xiaomi wristband 2 which is a smart band. All right? So as you can see here we have the Xiaomi wristband which is the latest edition as you can check out over here. We have the box and this is the brand new um, packaging, the, the white um, paper or the white um, um, box. All right? So I'm going to show you how water resistant this device is. So the Xiaomi Respond 2 is actually rated at a high P67 um, water resistant, meaning it can survive in up to a meter of water for 30 minutes. Now, a meter of water for 30 minutes would mean that um, if you were to convert a meter, that's about 39.3 inches of water. Now, it's recommended that you don't go swimming with it, but however, if it gets a little bit um, wet, or splash it should not damage the watch so today I'm gonna to put that to the test so I have a little makeshift apparatus right here involving some water and I have my timing device over here so what I'm gonna do is as you can see the watch is working fine and I'm just gonna slide it into this glass right here All right so as you can see it's actually still working All right and we're gonna put it to the ultimate test. So here I have the water, and you can notice the timestamp. We throw the water in. As you can see, the display is lighting up. Got my box a little bit wet. That should be fine. So there we go. So we're gonna wait. It's now 9:21, and we're gonna come back in. Um, exactly half an hour all right so do notice the timestamp so we're gonna leave this and see if it's still working after a full half hour test so this is just to see if the ratings on this device is actually correct in that it can survive up to 30 minutes in water all right guys guys we're back and we're at the five minute mark so we're just gonna give it a quick test just to see if it's actually still working I'm just gonna fish it out and I have no idea if this will kill my device. I love this thing so much, so I don't really want it to die. But if that's the case for science, <laughs> it's gonna actually die. But let's see if it's actually water resistant. All right, not getting a response. Let's clear off the display. Okay, here we go. So it's actually still working. All right, um, the difference in time is because of the, um, um, this is just to show the time lapse. So if you see a difference in time, it's just because uh, I've set them differently. This one is a little bit slow. This is just to show progression. Back in. As you can see. And we're going to wait. Next at a longer time period. Hey guys, we're here. And as you can see, the time has actually gone over the 30 minutes. So it's now way ahead of the rated 30 minutes. Um, in water, so I'm just gonna fish this out as I said I have no clue whether or not this has damaged the watch So I guess we're about to find out and now for the moment of truth. So let me just clean this off And it's very wet soak for about half an hour As I said, this is one of my favorite um, smart bands. Let's see if it actually comes on So as you can see guys, it's actually still working. I'm gonna clean this up. So um, Let's see if the features are actually still working as I see the display is toggling quite fine 33 percent 9 40 according to this as you can see according to the device I was using to test the time all right or to keep track of the time so as you can see guys the Xiaomi wristband 2 is actually good in water um, I wouldn't advise that you push it but should it fall into water it should be good all right guys this is Ricardo from Block Tech Tips with another quick tech tip or quick tech test all right guys so Ricardo saying goodbye until next time bye